got a lot of ideas from residents, participants on policy changes. What are some of the things that the government should think about to strengthen our social compact, to strengthen our safety net, to assure you that your inputs are being listened to, that we take them seriously and we've been thinking about how policies might be updated based on your feedback. There are six pillars to the Forward SG conversation. It's also a way for the 4G ministers led by DPM Lawrence Wong to move forward in a different way to address problems that we face today in different ways but also to anticipate what it will be like 10, 20 years from now. And so the whole idea for Forward Singapore is to say that Singapore has reached a point in our development where we have to start thinking differently about what we get from society and what we give back to society in return. Now, there are other opportunities for helping the less fortunate or the more vulnerable in our society. Having that kind of uh, events uh, more regularly uh, within the community, I think that actually helps. We are going already on the right track. We are promoting multi-racial uh, society. We are helping each other to improve, encouraging each other. I think going down to the level to having their familyness. So, what we are going to go forward is to really think about being inclusive, and not think about how to put these people in very far away places we all don't see them. They should be among us. As a grassroots volunteer, we try to have these like big events, you know, where people can come together, like block parties, uh, festive occasions, and it's also really important to continue for the residents to strengthen these bonds in their own more private spaces, so like within their levels or between the neighbours who are side by side. Please step forward and join us in carrying out these projects as well. And the more we put into this compact, I think the more we will get out of it, and the better and stronger Singapore will be in the future.